Hey there, Dreamlanders. Sorry for the radio silence lately. A lot of things to deal with in the waking world, you know. I wish I could say more, but I don't think there are things I should share. And you know how strict I am the most about sharing my private life. But of course, I didn't make this video just to say that. I mean, I started making this because I couldn't take being so silent anymore. So yeah, well, since it's Halloween month, I guess I'll share to you this idea I have about my alternate self if I had one. I could act it out, but it's just uh, really out there. <laughs> and by really out there, I mean that alternate me would be the typical inexplicably famous sleazebag, you know. It's pretty easy to imagine, yeah, but I'm still in disbelief over the respect I'm getting from you all. Sure, I'm gay, but I'm still a guy, and if I'm not getting really bad looks from homophobes and misogynists, I'm getting bad looks from uh, misandrists, you know. <laughs> oh, well, anyway, back to talking about how my alternate self would probably be. Well, I guess he'd still be as scarred and gargly as I am but with a lot more damage because of all his abuse. Like, on top of hurting others more, he'd be hurting himself more, of course. And he'd be frequently using his health condition as an excuse to be a jerk. And, uh, man, I really don't want to imagine enforcing collaborations and working with a manager and pretty much doing this whole VTubing thing the usual way. You get what I mean, right? So yeah, I guess that's all I got for this one. Uh, I'm really sorry again for the crap content and updating and all. Guys, but I guess I should also thank you all very much for your concern. So yeah, thank you very much again. Alright, now... Yeah. Wait, this isn't my... Where am I? What? <laughs> <laughs> Bitch.